Hey guys, so today um, we will be learning how to make a Roblox plane for Blender um, in Roblox plane in Blender. Um, so yeah, we'll teach you how to um, how to texture your plane, how to import the plane, how to export the plane, everything. So. I've taken the 787 Dreamliner and as you can see I've downloaded this here and I've got the blueprint here as well which I'm going to delete right now so you guys are uh, not confused so just going to write this is numpad this is numpad 3 okay so let's go into numpad 3 and write view and download this blueprint or whatever you're using and just drag it in blender here once you've done that uh, you should see this little arrow here just click on the arrow and you should see this little pop-up and with the pop-up um, everything here has to be zero so once you've done that um, scale the uh, plane up so the blueprint up here as shown and shift a to add a mesh Q mesh cylinder and rotate it 90 degrees and right click and click on shade smooth. Okay. Then that we've done that, we're going to find the length of the 787 8 and it's 57 meters. Okay, so 57 meters. Uh, so on the z-axis we have to write 57 and you should get this. So now scale your blueprint up using S um, and using these uh, axis options scale the uh, position the blueprint just um, on this cylinder uh, just on the fuselage and actually quickly rename your cylinder fuselage and your uh, blueprint blueprint and with this just um, do this so your blueprint is just scaled up uh, just up, just manages to be scaled just okay yes yeah, so it's a tiny bit smaller perfect okay this is good all right so now click here on wireframe and zoom it in I'm actually just going full screen for this so you want to zoom it in and bring the blueprint some just bring the blueprint somewhere here like in the middle there we go and click on the cylinder and click on tab or if you don't like shortcut keys click on edit mode here and click on s and then click on z so this scales it on the z axis and just scale it up until you can see like they're matching and once you've done that simply i think that yeah that's done for this so now go on the top where it says Z and click on the blueprint and do shift D here click on escape and rotate this uh, oh sorry rotate this on the Z axis at 0 degrees so now if you go in front view or numpad 1 you can see you have the blueprint here so just grab it and position it somewhere like this here and just to see how well it is yep so the top part is fine but we have to get this part correct so I'm actually just gonna click on the blueprint again and just position it something like okay now that that's done uh, shift so it should select all automatically or if it hasn't just click on A so it selects everything then S and then X so it scales this on the Z X axis and the front of the plane is done looks good okay now that you've done that um, I think it's time to model the plane so uh, go to numpad 3 again and here you should have your plane here now we're going to be adding loop cuts so you can find them in edit mode and here we have to simply position the plane like this and then just keep going with these um, it should seem it should be easy but oh no no we don't need that oh, uh, 
thing I added an extra one. There we go. Let's keep going like this. And like this, this. Okay, I think we've added enough loop cuts and now it's time to scale the plane. So you can add as many loop cuts as you like. The more you find detail with the better. Anyways, so click on Alt and click on one of these uh, loop cuts. A lot of these should select the whole loop cut and zoom in and click on S and then click on Z. So this should help you. So the first one has to be very tiny. It has to be just a dot. Just manage to be a dot. So. Sorry about that. Okay, anyway, so uh, just uh oh where, where am I? Um okay, cool. So right view and I'm pad three again. Here we have this. Yep, so it's scaled in, so click on G and then click on Z and just zoom this put this here. And with that done, um simply do the same for. I'm just gonna increase my brightness because I can. Okay. Simply just do the same for these guys too, the other ones. Oh, there we go. Scale this, scale this on the z axis. Um, and then grab this one. Everything has to be done in the z axis for this. Please do not um, just scale this. Just use S to scale this because if it's not on the z axis, there's gonna be an issue. And this issue, it's very annoying. Okay, so we have that done. Okay, scale this up on the Z axis again, just add loop cuts. And yeah, just keep doing this. Um, just keep doing this until the nose has good detail. Okay, I think it is pretty f good now. And just do this for these this part now. I'm just gonna scale out. Uh oh my Mac, my cooling fan has been turned on. Oh, that's not a good sign. Anyways, just keep doing this quickly, and I think I'm going to make a cut here, just so just keep scaling your plane here like this. But and yeah, so I'm just gonna cut, put a cut here, tiny cut here, and yeah, guys. So just keep going, and anyways, so. Okay, so, um, okay, so I've got this done here, as you can see, um, basically you just had to, um, you know, just make the plane, scale it like this, um, and then go on solid view and get out of, it. and you can see it looks just okay, but just okay from the side, but from the front, um, <laughs> no. <laughs> so what do you actually want to do? First click on the blueprints and just click here on the image and say and display only on aligned axis. Oh hold on. Oh, oh, I need to my MacBook. Pull one out. There we go. Right, um basically what you have to do is just uh Go inside view and click here and just display an only aligned axis and the same for this one, this blueprint, display only an aligned axis. Now what we have to do is you go and in, go in top view and select one of the blueprints, so I'm going to select this one, go shift D, uh, you can move this and then click escape. Once you've done that, rotate this on the X axis. And I should just turn this off, just gonna minimize this one. 
zero and here now what you want to do is oh my gosh what just happened <laughs> uh, uh oh i think i yep i zoomed in way too much my plane uh, uh, <laughs> oh okay what is happening hold on Okay, well, actually, I have to. Yeah, so basically, I just zoomed in a lot on my plane. If you encounter this, just use the magnifying glass to zoom in and zoom out. Okay, go on the top and select this blueprint, and just position it just here. And actually, I'm gonna put my plane in wireframe mode so I can see it better. Okay. Um, No, not the plane, the blueprint. Zero point zero two, let's move it here. Perfect, perfectly matched. Now go into edit mode and do the same thing here, except you're scaling this on the z axis and just move this. And just making sure it's correct and correctly made. Each and everything is in the middle. Uh, it's a bit hard like this, but just do this. Um, just do this like this, and continue with this. Uh, do it all the way, and I'll just make a cut. Not right now, but until we've reached the bit of the top. So there you guys might have to start doing that because I don't have a lot of memory in my laptop so subscribe so I can buy a new PC <laughs> or I can uh, buy a PC not a new PC but a PC <laughs> anyways uh, I'll also link my discord uh, so you guys can message me if you're having any issues <laughs> um, okay like this Okay, uh, like this. Oh, scale on the axis. What did I just do here? So I'm using axis. Um, Okay, so as you guys have the have some brief idea on what I am doing, just keep doing this until yeah, just keep doing this until you've reached the top. I'll make a cut now, um, but of course you can DM me in my Discord anytime you like. My DMs are open. Just send a friend request first because. For security reasons, I don't like my DMs to be open just to everyone. Or just tag me in my server with the issue, I don't really mind. Uh, let's close this one. Um, Alright guys, uh, so yeah, just keep doing this until you've like reached the bottom of your plane. And yeah, I'll show you, I'll just show you how it looks like. Okay, so... Um, oh. So I've done this here, as you can see, um, just the same thing. Uh, just follow the blue, just follow the blueprint, and yeah. So I think I've done a pretty okay job here. Let's have a look. Um, some of you looks fine. This nose, however, something, something fish, something funny is happening here. Oh, okay, I, I know why. So what I have done is here, I made a slight mistake. So I should have actually split this and same with the Z axis. A singular dot. Okay, so yeah, looks nice. Um, it looks okay actually. It's 
make sure to send me a message on Discord showing me how your plane works, so I can have a, I can also give you some criticism or compliments. Uh, from the front, looks pretty okay. Next, uh, no, next lesson, next lesson, I'll teach you how to make the um, the cargo doors, the doors, um, these, uh, the cockpit, this, and a lot of a lot of things. So yeah, make sure to subscribe, like, leave a like, and tell, get a comment down so I know that people are watching. Otherwise, I might not. I don't know if I can if I'll continue this. So yeah. Um, Alright guys, have a good day again, and make sure to message me on my Discord just to show me how you're playing this guy, so, yeah, good luck.